Today, we're going to be going over Madden 23's best defense to use right now in the adjustments. Lock your opponent down. Lock down the run. Lock down the pass. Make sure that you hit that red subscribe button and drop a like on the video to help with the algorithm. I stream four to five days a week, so you want to have your notifications on. Let's get into today's Madden 23 best defense breakdown. My whole LB, boom, come out here, look for work, and we should have either the cornerback or we should have a disengage. All right, we are back in the big nickel over G. WS Blitz 1. Now, I broke down the Blitz version yesterday, so if you didn't watch that, go check out yesterday's video. Right here, we are going to crash the line to the wide side of the field, okay? We are in man coverage. We have the Blitz and angle coming down, and I am going to shoot any gaps, okay? So, on that play, you've seen seven people in the box. Now, second and ten, that dropping blitzer. If you're not gonna blitz him, I'm gonna use him as a man up person, either with the tight end or the receiver over there. So right there, I'm gonna help with the tight end and we have double coverage on one of the stars on the field. If you pay attention to this, I'm running underneath the tight end. I'm willing to let them get separation underneath. If they throw it underneath for a two yard pass, a three yard dump off, that's okay. You can big hit them, cause a fumble, or have an incomplete pass. Right here, you can see I'm doing the same exact thing. To stop the C routes inside quarter or outside third, your cornerback. Then I take that guy that's dropping down the safety and I man him up. So he has that C route to the left. We have the pressure coming off the edge. If you wanna get pressure, all you gotta do is spread your defensive line. No crashing or anything spread your defensive line you want to make sure that you are doing this on a passing situation so if you are stopping the run okay they're going to eventually have to throw the ball that's when you can be confident spread your defensive line now right here you can see the tight end is going to have an advantage against your linebacker or your safety so that's a route that you want to keep an eye on but you are user in the deep blue zone so you want to be aware of any routes that's breaking back across the middle okay so right there he tries to throw a corner route you know a lot of players are going to spam corner routes i have inside shade on my slot cornerback it's also very important to put inside shade on one of your safeties either the drop down blitzer or the other safety. So if they run a trips type look or a gun tight type look, you can have two inside shades on the inside receivers, okay? Right there, that cornerback ran the route for the wide receiver and we were able to click on and get a pick. Now, this is gonna be 80% of the offenses that you face. It's gonna be corner routes, corner routes, whips, slants, and this defense is gonna bag your opponent up the best defense in Madden 23 in the adjustments. As far as shading, I'm not doing any shading. That drop down safety, I'm using him as a cross man. So if you're gonna do any kind of shading, you can do the outside, but only use that on a trips type look in case they have two routes coming to the inside and then a corner route. You can individually shade by pushing A, that'll bring up the icon and you can individually shade one cornerback at a time. <laughs> 